MMA Insider here with Chris Taylor, matchmaker at PFC. You dropped a big bombshell tonight. You're going to be going pro in October. Talk a little bit about the venue, where it's going to be at, and uh, such. We're going to be doing it in Abington, down at the Washington County Fairgrounds. You know, I mean, we've been doing this since 2008, uh, so saving the show, you know, it's that time. I mean, uh, you know, we're, we're, we're hitting a good, a good backing, and uh, I think we're ready. You know, we've got, we've got great talent around here. That could be really good. So, you know, that's that's just the next step. That's where you go from here. Now I know we're good six, seven months, or uh, yeah, about six months away. Um, I know it's too early, but who are some of the fighters you're considering about putting on the card? Um, yeah. We're going to use uh, probably Gene Lady will be one. Uh, I know he's, he's been working for a while with us. Um, we may, may bring some uh, Fit Factory guys from down 3 FC way up here. Um, probably going to use some uh, Absolute Jiu Jitsu guys and uh, you know, probably quite a few of the East Tennessee guys since we'll be right there close to where they're from. Uh, and Billy Johnson, you know, dropped a bombshell that he's going to throw off of this, so we're definitely going to use him also. Uh, now, what do you think the biggest uh, uh, the biggest difference is between throwing an amateur show, other than money? I mean, money, of course, is the main thing. But what is what's other than money? What's the main thing that's the, the biggest difference? Well, with the state of Virginia, you know, they, they don't regulate the amateur mixed martial arts, which you know I'm not really a big fan of. Uh, you know, Tennessee does, and it seems to help out a whole lot. But you know, yeah, the money not that big of a difference as far as putting on the show but you know you, I mean, you get into uh, you know, paying your fighters and stuff um, but you know I mean, it, it's, it's going to be an experience a learning process you know I've, I've got some good guys that's going to help me out uh, you know we're just going to see what we can do with it. Who are some of the people that are going to be helping you out with this? Uh, Tim Lloyd, Gene Click, uh, Shane Goins, you know all those guys have done pro shows dealt with the, the fighters you know uh, uh, I gotta give a, you know a shout out to Tim and Gene. You know they they they, they helped me out a lot. Um, and Shane, you know Shane, he's, he's helped me out. He's done pro shows for Cage Bra. So uh, that, those, those guys will help me out there, and you know, we'll get this thing going. And I'm sure with having Tim and Gene on your side, I'm sure they provided a lot of insight for you of things to expect right. with your with your pro fight. Um, what, what what are the things you are expecting to maybe not be give you trouble, but maybe be a little bit more hassle than usual? What are some of the things you're you're not looking forward to? I should say. Uh, I guess dealing with the state. I mean, you know, I mean that, that's going to be something different we've never done before. So uh, that you know that's going to be something that's going to take a little learning process. Um, you know, I mean, I don't think it's going to be bad. I, you know, I, I talked personally with the athletic commissioner. He seems like a really nice guy. He's helped me out. He's worked with me. Kind of gave me a lot of info on what I need to do and what I need to do. So uh, that would probably be uh, one of the biggest hassles. And, you know, going to a new venue. You know, we've never ventured down towards Addington. Uh, we've done a show in Appalachia. And, you know, we were out of our element. Uh, we really took the show on short notice. But, uh, you know, it's a good fight. And, uh, and, uh, you know, the, just the crowd wasn't there. You know, I don't know where we messed up on it, but you know that that probably scares me more than anything is you know, getting the people there because they're not familiar with us. So. Uh, so, and not only that, it's actually going to be the first ever pro am event in the state of Virginia. Is that correct? Uh, in Southwest Virginia. In Southwest Virginia. Yeah. So we are going to be making history uh, with that. So PFC eight, make sure you uh, get out there October. Yeah. October 5th. Make sure you get out there. You've heard it here first on MMA Insider. Thank you very much, man. Appreciate it. Thank you.